you guys have been dealing with someone who is very close to you, near and dear, that you may have been, you know, grew up with or someone you may have been friends with really, really close. You trust this person. They trust you. You tell them your business. They tell you theirs. It's just like, okay, we real close. Like this is, I know this is my friend. I know for real that this person in my family is for me. I know for real. Like this, the main person I can always turn to when I'm going through something. Literally, this person is dealing with someone who is on the darker side. They're literally doing all kinds of spell work behind this person's back. They may have become very close to the person that you're close to. That may be now their best friend and y'all both are the best friends, right? But this situation is going in a direction where that other best friend or that this person is dealing with it's starting to get jealous of you guys' relationship, how close you guys are. That person talks about you all the time. They talk about you in so many good ways. Like everything that they say about you, it's always something good. But the other friend is not liking that. They ain't messing with it. The other best friend is actually using some form of witchcraft, divination, all kinds of stuff. This person grew up in this. They were raised in doing spells to get what they want. They've been talking mess about you. To them but being on the slick side you know starting to tell them different things to plant seeds into their mind now that they have these seeds planted it's starting to be a concern and what's so crazy is this person is not even aware that they are being a victim of this person's evil work they're literally moving around as though nothing's happened they're starting to even think to themselves should they stop talking to you this person may have actually ghosted you or stopped talking to you they don't talk to you the same because of what this person has done none of this would have ever happened if the person you were dealing with was actually woke or really connected to the most high because they would have been listening to their spiritual discern they would have known so there's no reason for you to worry about it because you know the same if god is moving somebody out of your life you might as well go ahead and just keep it moving you know, because they didn't need to be in your circle. No way. You don't need no squares in your circle. As I always say, you're literally dealing with someone who is wicked. This is how they normally keep relationships, even trying to keep a man in their life or a woman in their life using these manipulative tactics through spell work to try to keep their relationships going. It's crazy because I can tell that you were actually someone who was near and dear to this person as well before all this happened. But that other best friend or the other person has literally gotten in their ear. They're listening to everything this person is saying. They've already been bewitched. It's over with, you know? So all we have to do now is move on and find something else to do. Because <laughs> we definitely don't want to be around someone who is best friends or really close to someone who is into stuff like that. They're literally going to keep trying to keep you away from this person. Your life is going to be so much better knowing that you released this person away from your life. Even though I know in your, deep in your heart, you really love this person. I know it hurts. It's tough. It's something that some of us can't even really fathom the thought. It just keeps going through your mind like, wow, I can't believe we're not as close as we used to be. You may even see, look at pictures and videos of you guys like, wow, you know, that friendship breakup actually, it, it hurts too. Just like it would an actual relationship. It hurts too. When you have to cut off family, that's you have to heal from stuff like that. And that's what you're going to have to do. That's what's happening. You're being healed from a lot of the things that you have went through with this person. You're actually being cleansed and purified from the ways of which this person left you out and stopped talking to you like that. But it's no reason for you to be upset. You're going to find a new group. There's going to be more people coming around to be there for you and to be there to talk to. It'll definitely happen.